You know, one of the things I like about you is that you're fun and bubbly. Those are two things, actually. Fun and bubbly. Oh, yeah, two things. <laughs> <laughs> Just two. Amongst others. Oh, this is so pretty. Strange. Why? You're kind of right. I was at some point a very bubbly person. But I guess I lost a part of me somewhere along the line during life's troubles. So it's just strange that anyone would think that I'm still fun and bubbly in my present state. Present state? Do you want to throw more light? Uh, too depressing. Getting too late? Would your husband be angry? No. I'm just thinking about my son. He should be in bed by now. Oh. So you're not worried about your husband? He's a big boy. I'm a big girl. My husband doesn't care if I stay out late. Oh, that's great. Stay out late then. <laughs> Is he that bad? Things change. Love like so many other things turn on a dime. Not in my case. My love has staying power. <laughs> I wasn't expecting you to say otherwise. Yes, it's true. You'll mm. see. We will. Will we? Maybe. Maybe not. I'll go with the former. <laughs> See, my husband is doing his own thing. The strange part is that it doesn't seem to bother me. It happens. Right? Yeah. Especially if you've already given yourself to someone else. No, I don't think so. So, it's not like I haven't given my heart to someone else. It's just that I... I shouldn't have said that. Yes. Yes, you should. Tell me, who, who will you give me your heart to? <clears throat> no, I didn't just say that. Come on, just tell me. I have to go. Wait. I really want to know whom you've given your heart to. guy you've given your heart to. It's going to be unfair because I already gave you mine. That's a big gamble. Um. The all time my favor. So. Wait. 